Hi Taurus, it's Elle here to do a quick reading for you. What we're gonna do is go through how you feel about your person, how your person feels about you. We're gonna get some advice for you and then we're going to get a potential outcome. So let's get into it. Thank you God for blessing Taurus with a clear, concise message from you. All right, so let's get into it. Um, keep in mind that uh, all links are below. You can uh, go over to the website, book there. And if you need to get in contact with me, my email address and everything is below. All right, so let's see. How does Taurus feel about their person? How does Taurus feel about their person? How does Taurus feel about their person? Okay. Ooh, Taurus. So you feel like the devil. Um, you could be just dealing with the Capricorn, all right? Um... Let's see. How does Taurus feel about their person? How does Taurus feel about their person? How does Taurus? Oh, jeez! All these cards came out. All right, so we're gonna put them back. If they come out again, then we'll, you know, the Four of Swords. All right, so the Devil and the Four of Swords. Um, I heard like persuasive. Yeah, you feel like this person was persuasive maybe in having you in a third party situation. Um, they only wanted, you know, one thing from you. Um, you feel like uh, the relationship grew unhealthy because there was no growth. It was one sided. Um, this person was dependent on your energy, dependent on giving you or getting something from you, or you giving something to them. The devil card says that um, maybe they were addicted to your your um, your sex, your love. They were. You feel like this person is um, obsessed with you. You know, maybe obsessed with your sex, or obsessed with you, or obsessed with having you, or having access to you. Maybe you feel like um, the devil card could also talk about being um, easily uh, persuaded or um, led astray or manipulated or allowing yourself to be. What is the, uh, how does Taurus feel about, uh, how does Taurus feel about uh, this? I'm sorry, how does Taurus person feel about them? How does Taurus person feel about them? The temperance card. So they feel like they just need to, um, they feel like with you, they, it's a wealthy connection. It's healthy also. They feel like they're trying to um, have a better connection with you, take the middle ground with you, uh, make things better. They feel like maybe um, divine intervention so that you guys can come back together or at least be friends or salvage the connection they don't want you to be completely over them you could feel like this person wanted you in a third party situation for a very long time they kept you there they kept the relationship stagnant they feel like um yeah they, they want this they feel like you ignoring them right now, Taurus, is temporary. They feel like they just need to say the right thing, do the right thing. They need to make some compromise with you and then uh, things will work out better. Somebody doesn't have what you need or what you... Somebody doesn't have enough to support themselves or support you or support the relationship. What is the advice for Taurus here? What is the advice for Taurus? What is the advice the eight of wands move forward. Um, it's gonna be, it's gonna be an opportunity to speak your truth and state your intentions. Maybe that you're done with this and you're over it and you're moving forward. What is the devil card for how Taurus feels about their person? The will of fortune. All right, so you feel like there is no change. Toxic, codependent change so you feel like they need to change this you feel like maybe this break or this halt in the relationship this time out gave them time to change and maybe this person feels like with you they're just gonna come back and try to make some compromise or 
um, salvage the connection because they don't they don't like not being near you or having access to you or talking to you. The advice here is to state your intentions. What is what will come of the out? What will come of the eight of wands? What will come of the eight of wands? The three of wands, the five of wands. Like so, maybe you guys will jump back in the sacks, jump jump back in the bed together. Yep. I don't I don't see this being grounded. I see you guys going in a circle and then somebody regrets not saying things and not acting the right way and it goes back into missing one another. This is like a This is a This is one of those cyclical situations where you have to um come out of the cycle and the cycle is doing the same thing over and over again, taking uh, taking this person back, knowing that the relationship has grown unhealthy, and maybe that's why you're taking a break. But then when you come back together, you, you, you figure out that this person hasn't changed. Um, it's just as turbulent as it was before you left. It's just as chaotic, it's just as Many people involved, third party, eight party, 10 party situation. I don't know. Um, you see that somebody still isn't settled. They're not going to stick around. Um, they're not going to let the grass grow under their feet. Somebody could be coming back around for finances or their finances have changed. Again, somebody can't take care of themselves or um, they want you to take care of them. Somebody has a lot of different people here in the energy. Uh, what is the hidden element here? What is the hidden element between... Taurus and their person. Yeah, family changes. Maybe somebody's having a baby, getting married. Um, somebody all of a sudden changed gracefully aged. Somebody needs to mature, grow up, health care change. Uh, yeah, somebody wanted to get out of this relationship because it, it became toxic and no longer healthy. When something is toxic, then it's not good for you. It's not healthy. So maybe this is what you need to do because it's like somebody wants you to be a long term third party girlfriend type situation. They don't want you to see the truth of the matter. They don't want you to see that because then you close out the cycle tours and you go elsewhere. Yeah, in a new direction. But they don't want you to see this, um, that they don't have any intentions for the relationship outside of having sex with you and having access to you. This is what I have for you. If it resonates, go over to the website book there. Ask a question or two by texting uh, your question to the number below. Come watch me live every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday night, 8.30 p.m. Standard Time tonight. Um, you can come for the collective reading. You can ask questions. Taurus, thank you for being here. Thank you uh, for showing up. Um, all links are below if you need to get in contact with me. Take care, guys.